Orders of the President of the United States. 52 soldiers raised their right hand, signifying the ultimate commitment by swearing to defend the Constitution of the United States of America. This ceremony is unique as today's soldiers face fewer career opportunities and higher standards. I mean, it's tough to re-enlist in our Army today. We keep the very best and brightest, and the fact that you're getting the re-enlist today is special, very special. Special for our Army, special for our nation. Support the Constitution. Him to come out today and re-enlist us, I felt very honored. This ceremony marks a renewed commitment by these soldiers to the people of the United States of America and the U.S. Army. Soldiers re-enlisting today here in Afghanistan, it shows their great heart to re-enlist under these circumstances. Major General Stein closed the ceremony with words of gratitude and pride in what these soldiers have done and will do. And so from my heart today, I want to tell all of you, whether you're standing here in formation or you're out there on the parade field, thank you for your service. Thank you for what you do. Thank you for who you are. And from my heart, on behalf of all the American people, congratulations to all of you. For Task Force Lifeliner, Bagram Airfield, Afghanistan, I'm Army Staff Sergeant Peter Sinclair.